Hey! Go gang, what's up? Anyways, today we're doing some Minecraft Mythbusters, and um, if you haven't seen by the title, at least I hope, we are doing myths all about stairs. Why are you staring at me? Ha, puns. <laughs> Funny. Ha, well, uh, th this what I made right here is actually something made comprised of completely just just stairs. It's pretty pretty cool for design or whatever. It's 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 it's, it's kind of utilizing a glitch in the game that I found. So again, utilizing that glitch, basically what you do is you place down two, uh, sorry, two stone uh, stairs like that. Then you place down one like that. And another like that. Now this is great and all, but there, there's still like a like a place that you can exit right here, right? So basically, all you have to do to fix that is to go like this, and then you go like this again, then you go like this, and boom, and then you got yourself a full square. Now here, let me just. Okay, so now let's get on to the myths. Okay, so this first method, um, or myth that I'm testing, is when you have a bunch of arrows in a dispenser, and a staircase in front of it, will you still be able to fire the dispenser? Because this would be good for builds, like, somebody's walking up the stairs to your castle. You obviously want to fire at them, but, so, I'm just gonna... Okay. Okay, I don't think it fired them. Here, let's try upside down. Yeah, still nothing. Okay, so it doesn't shoot through the stairs. So this myth is busted. Arrows do not shoot through the stairs. Okay, this next myth that I am looking at is if there is a noticeable difference between climbing up stairs with um, auto jump disabled versus auto jump enabled. Now, right now, I have auto jump off, as you can see because it would jump me over here. Anyways, auto jump is really annoying sometimes, but I want, I'm wondering if it'll help you like jump and sprint up the stairs at the same time. So let's see if there's a notable difference between like the time that it takes me to sprint up like this versus the time that it will with auto jump. Because, I mean, it might not even be worth it if it's not noticeable. Because think about it, then you're just sacrificing an annoying feature for just like a couple. Oh, yep, that is a big difference. Holy crap, let's look at that again. Holy. Oh my god. Well, I didn't get sprinting that time. That was <laughs> without just walking up the stairs with auto jump. It's like the sprinting without auto jump. Oh, that one failed for some reason. Come on, sprint. Anyways, I think it's actually worth it. Holy crap, it's worth it to go up mines with auto jump on. See, I have auto jump on. So this myth is... Confirmed. There is a massive visual difference between going upstairs without auto jump versus auto jump on. Okay, guys. So with this next myth, I'm going to be testing if you can um, use other things than stairs for AFK pools. As most of you probably know, there's a thing called an AFK pool where you kind of just stand in it. And uh, here, I'll just build it really quick, like so. And done and here let me just place the sign right here and boom okay so basically this is an afk pool if you don't know what it is it's when like say you're on a server and you're away um say you're on a server and you're like away like going eating or something um you just sit in this and it keeps you spinning in a circle around and around forever and it's just a fun little thing to build well here i'll show you so basically i'm not i have my hands off of my um controls like off of my keyboard and mouse and it just pushes you basically the water pushes you around in a circle upstairs and uh over the sign and back around again and without the sign it would just like push over there so it's impossible without the sign but i'm wondering if you can do it without stairs. I've only seen them built with stairs, so I'm going to try it with a slab, and uh, we'll see what happens. So let me just build the basic outline for it right here. Let me put down a slab. Let me place down a sign. And the reason that I think this might, may or may not work, the reason I think it may work is because, well, it's a slab and you still, you still go up it. 
but the reason I think it might not work is they're kind of shaped differently, but they still have like the same effects. It, it, so I think this will work. That's my hypothesis. Okay, let's try it. Again, hands off my keyboard. Okay, let me just move the mouse. Oh, okay, so I think it works. So this myth is confirmed. Slabs do work with an AFK pool. Okay guys, so now while I'm uh, sitting in our slab AFK pool, I'd like to talk about um, some things on the channel. So as you know, the shoutout series has not happened for like, the past two weeks. Um, I'm going to make one and try and put it out tomorrow. Don't mark my words, but I really have no excuses. It's all my fault. So, you know, anyways, just, uh, yeah. Yeah, sorry about that. Anyways, um, my goal is to get to 100 subscribers by the end of August. I think I can do it. It's really just, um, you guys are great. You've been supporting me. You've been checking out my latest videos. It's, it's just, thank you. And, um, for all you loyal fans out there making it this far in the video, that means a lot to me. Because some people just, uh, like, like thank, thank you for even just clicking on the video. But some people just click on the video and click away. Which I'm perfectly fine with. Um, it's just... You know, it's really nice when people watch the entire video. So again, thank you guys so much. And uh, let's get on to the next myth. Hey guys, so with this next myth, I'm wondering if mobs will choose climbing up these blocks opposed to climbing up stairs to get to food. Like the carrot that I have. Um, so I have, underneath the ground, I have some redstone signals running. I have this button, which I'm going to click. It sets off some redstone. It'll give me a few seconds to get up and get in position, uh, even, to, like, right here, to, um, attract the mob, so let's do this. Okay. <laughs> I think I should have thought this through. Hold up. Let me get another test. <laughs> okay, so now I'm gonna press this button, and I'm going to, uh, run up patch in the stairs. There we go. Let's see. Oh, the pig chose the stairs! Okay, I wonder if that's just the natural instinct or something else. Here, I'm gonna run this test again. Okay, here we go. Okay, this time he chose those blocks. Things were altered. Oh, dang, this is one smart pig. Okay, so I think there's something... I think it's just kind of random. Or there's some faults in my experiment. There's probably faults in my experiment. Like, it wasn't static. Like, this wasn't patched up every single time. Uh... Though it did seem when it was perfectly even, he did the pig did choose the stairs and not the block. So I'm gonna take that as confirmed. Pigs and other mobs use the stairs over normal blocks. Well, anyways, guys, thank you for watching this hysterical episode of Minecraft Mythbusters, all about stairs. And um, I hope you found this video hysterical. Um, but also, sorry if this was kind of a strange video. I've been off of the YouTube grind for a little bit. I don't know why, but I just I have been taking a break. Uh, stuff has been getting in my way of doing YouTube. But anyways, guys, I hope you all enjoyed. Leave a like if you did enjoy. And as always, I'll see you in the next video, guys. Peace.